Protesters are ramping up pressure on LA City Councilman Kevin DeLeon and Gil Cedillo to resign over racially charged comments recorded and leaked to the media. Yeah, several people are now camping outside DeLeon's Eagle Rock home. Let's go right to Carlos Soceto. He's there live. He's got developments for us. Carlos? Yeah, good afternoon. It has been a week since these racist recordings were leaked, but the uproar has not subsided. We're outside near Kevin De Leon's home here in Eagle Rock. And take a look here. You can see people camped out here. They're protesting or hoping to put pressure on the council member to resign. They say they're not going anywhere until both he and Gil Cedillo step down. City Hall has been rocked by the latest scandal involving an audio recording where Latino leaders could be heard making disparaging racist remarks during a redistricting meeting last year. So far, De Leon and Cedillo have resisted calls to step down for their participation in those comments. Neither have made public statements since issuing apologies last week. Now, former council president Nuri Martinez resigned five days ago. Demonstrators say the protests will continue until both council members do what's best for their constituents and the city of LA. The council chaos led to Friday's meeting's cancellation. Now, a group of black civil rights leaders is demanding that the new council president be one of the African American members. And a BLM activist has this message for De Leon. Take a listen. We leave when you leave. So if you want to go back to your normal life, whatever that may look like after what you did, you need to resign because we are not going anywhere. You will not have a good place to sleep until you leave office. So we're calling on the city council once again, when they nominate another president, someone who looks like a community that we want represented with empowerment, namely an African-American. <clears throat> Now, this week's council meeting will be held virtually on Tuesday because of a recent COVID exposure, but these activists say they'll be out here until both Cedillo and De Leon step down.